update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finished down 96, NASDAQ off 67, S&P's down 8.5. Gold, gold contract up $29.70, trading at $21.25 an ounce, breaking highs. Silver up 76 cents, $24.12, platinum up 15.60, Copper flat, oil down a buck 22, trading at $78.75 a barrel, notes and bonds. 10 year note, down seven ticks, eight ticks rather. 110.25, the 30 year down 14 at 119.19, and the 10 year right now, folks, is at 4.215. Now, check it out for the last three months, the high is 4.3, 4 the low is 3.2. For the last six months, the high is 4.9, the low is 3.7, we're at 4.2. And King Dollar, King Dollar, come on, don't be hiding on me. Where'd you go? Oh, my God. I got to get this straightened out. DXY. There you are. King dollar down 26 ticks. 103,835. Euro at 108. Yen at 150. British pound at 126. And we get over and take a look at this gold contract, folks, okay? Bottom line is that you have, and this is what you like to see, you have two full days of wide price spread accelerated volume. We did 302,000 contracts on Friday. We did 307,000 contracts today. We get action here. Uh, and I believe this will be a closing high because we actually hit, there was a spike that we hit 2071, 2171. But at that, the day that it gave it up totally, went to 2171 and closed out at uh, 2000. 70 or something. It'd come down 100 bucks like in a heartbeat. Uh, we go to the GDX. We take it. doesn't matter which ones you look at. You had um, wide price spread in all of them. GDX did another 48 million today. You did 44 million on Friday. We get, we get some real action out here. And then if you take a look at the GLD, the GLD broke all highs. That's the bottom line. And we have volume behind the move. That's the love of it. Have a great night, folks. A safe night. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. Kicks us off 9 a.m. Great show, folks.